Have you ever wondered how futures contracts work in finance? Perhaps you've heard of them, but you're not quite sure how they function. Well, you're in the right place. Today, we're going to break down the concept of futures contracts step by step to help you understand this critical component of the financial markets. A futures contract in the world of finance is a standardized legal agreement to buy or sell something at a predetermined price at a specific future date. It's like making a deal today for something that will happen tomorrow. This vast and complex system known as the futures market allows participants to hedge against risk, speculate on price movements, and manage their portfolios. Key features of futures contracts include standardization, delivery, and marking to market. Standardization means that futures contracts have set parameters regarding the underlying asset, quantity, quality, and delivery date. This aids in trading and reduces the risk of one party failing to meet their obligations. Delivery refers to the settlement of contracts, typically through physical delivery of the underlying asset, although cash settlement is also an option. Marking to market is a daily process where the contract price is adjusted to reflect the current market price of the underlying asset. This keeps both parties in the contract updated on their potential profits or losses. Futures contracts serve various purposes, such as hedging, speculation, and portfolio management. Hedging is a strategy used by businesses and individuals to protect against risk, such as changes in commodity prices, interest rates, or exchange rates. Speculation involves attempting to profit from price movements by predicting whether the price of the underlying asset will rise or fall. Portfolio management uses futures contracts to manage risk within a portfolio by offsetting holdings with futures contracts on correlated or inversely correlated assets. There are also different types of futures contracts, including commodity futures, financial futures, and index futures. Commodity futures involve the sale or purchase of physical commodities like agricultural products, metals, and energy. Financial futures relate to the sale or purchase of financial instruments like stocks, bonds, and currencies. Index futures track the performance of a broad market index, such as the S&P 500 or the NASDAQ composite. However, futures trading is not without risks. These include leverage, liquidity, and counterparty risk. Leverage in futures trading can control a large amount of the underlying asset with a small amount of capital, which can magnify profits but also amplify losses. Liquidity refers to the ease with which an asset can be bought or sold. Futures markets are not always as liquid as other financial markets, which can make it difficult to exit a position without incurring a large loss. Counterparty risk, although reduced through a clearinghouse, still exists to some degree. There is always a residual risk that the clearinghouse may default. In conclusion, futures contracts are powerful tools that can help manage risk, speculate on price movements, and manage portfolios. However, they are complex and carry significant risks. Therefore, before trading futures, individuals and businesses should carefully consider their investment objectives and risk tolerance. Remember, knowledge is power. The more you understand, the better decisions you can make.